Hey everyone, Ben Flanagan from Veg Entertainment here. Uh, wanting to show you guys uh, a little update to uh, Cafe Sync. This is in the global section. If you don't know how to get there, you hit this little button right there until you see the little uh, the world. It goes from uh, passersby to uh, regional to global. Uh, global, you can see some of the cards. Uh, we added uh, long title word wrap, which I don't know why I didn't have that before, but we have it now. Uh, various images from the uh, companies that I have either paid for or I've given to. Actually, anybody in the beta right now gets a free one. Uh, and then I also added a Jupiter Broadcasting thing because I'm going to tag you guys in this video because I'm an intention. Uh, I need I need more people using the program to, to get all the bugs worked out. So anyway, here's the Jupiter Broadcasting car. You tap on it once. It shows you the information. I didn't have really much information. Hold down on it. It'll pull up the uh, card info. Uh, various things that you can do. Of course, I didn't. I don't have their actual uh, phone number or email address, so none of these buttons right here work. But if you had the information, you could call them. You could text them. You could email them. Uh, this is the swap button. Uh, as you can see, the, the styling is actually from the Suru theme on Ubuntu Touch because that is my primary development platform. Uh, then you can add it to your saved files or you can just delete the card. And then you're going to watch this blurry video because I don't really know how to record from... Okay, anyway, doesn't matter. Okay, flipping to the right. Uh, their main page apparently has an RSS feed, which is cool. Uh, it looks like I need to do some uh, minor adjustments for the long title here. Uh, not a big deal, but there it is. Um, uh, okay, so yeah, uh, in the future you'll be able to swipe up uh, to see all the, the RSS feed things and we'll make sure that their images get put in there as well. Uh, if it's using WordPress, that is definitely coming up in the next release. Uh, so just keep that in mind. Here is their Twitter page, as you can see by the little birdie down here in the left lower uh, right hand corner. Uh, their latest tweet, uh, their fancy logo, their uh, kind of pixelated background, but what are you going to do? Uh, and then their latest tweet. Uh, and here are their unfiltered page, or their Patreon unfilter page, uh, and then their Tech Talk Today filter page, or you know what I'm trying to say. Uh, Patreon page, so you can click on those, read read the newest things. Now these are not live on Android; they are just screenshots or um, uh, generated, rendered images. Uh, so uh, it should automatically update every time that they go to a new location, or rather, I go to a new location because it's my card. Uh, but um, that feature is not completely sussed out because I don't have enough people using the program to find out if it really works or not. Uh, so, of course, and that is uh, it for that card. Uh, hitting the little button down here at the bottom, we'll slide it back down. I'm trying to do this through the camera, and I apologize for the blurriness. Uh, I don't know why it can't seem to continue, uh, can't seem to autofocus. Um, anyway, here's Hen and the Cox. They are, they are a really cool indie band from Denton. Uh, again, with all the buttons. Uh, this is the SoundCloud draw, uh, uh, plug-in. It makes a, kind of posterizes their information on SoundCloud. Tapping on it will take you to SoundCloud and their information. You can actually listen to them. Again, on Android, it does. Uh, it, it opens up the browser in Ubuntu, or, uh, on Ubuntu Touch. It actually opens up uh, its own browser within the application, so it's a little bit more integrated. Uh, they're uh, really snazzy well designed um, just by luck um, uh, Twitter page uh, Facebook is broken at the present moment so we're just gonna pretend like you didn't see that uh, and then so dictator public library and then there's another step page another Facebook thing YouTube uh, and then of course Another Twitter, because everybody, because Twitter is awesome and it actually is pretty easy to program to. So kudos to them. Uh, Eve's Garden, a friend of ours out of Lake Bridgeport. Uh, blah 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 blah. Usual same things. Uh, uh oh, where's all of her stuff? Okay, well that's interesting. Um, oops. All right, well that'll just end the video there. I just wanted to show you. I'll figure out what's going on with the the Etsy page. Um,
Yeah, there it goes. Uh, I don't know what was going on there. Okay, so this is Suzanne's Etsy page. Uh, as you can see, you can click on the individual items. She's got some really nice stuff there if you guys want to look at it. Uh, if you download Cafe Sync, her uh, card will be in global for most of you guys. So give her give her a couple bucks. She's she's worth the money. Um, that sounded awkward, but you know what I'm trying to say. Uh, and yeah, so so there's Cafe Sync and all of its glory. Oh, and there's also saved cards and all that other fun stuff. So, um, this is, would be a great thing to have at con, uh, conventions, uh, hint, hint, um, and you can share out, you know, Jupiter Broadcasting's card to other, uh, people, uh, and or anybody else that's using the application if you have, uh, services or you're an artist or whatever. Uh, and also, uh, just one last thing, just for this, for grins and giggles, uh, or really not grins and giggles, really, um, just because. Uh, if you flip, flip over, hold, long press, I'll show you what the swap button does. Hitting the swap button will generate this nice code here. Uh, it's a one-time code. You close this window. As it says, warning, closing this window invalidates code. Closing that window is now an invalidated code. Okay. If you click on, or you tap on the menu and you hit the little swap button down here in the lower right-hand corner, couldn't find a better place for it. Uh, it'll put in the, it'll bring up the code entry uh, dialog. Uh, putting in the code there and hitting say or the checkbox will save that code to your say or that card to your saved area. So if you guys aren't connected to the same Wi-Fi, as long as you have a data connection, you can still share out cards. All right, so that's it. Uh, I'm sure there's a lot more that I've done, but I can't think of anything at the present moment. Uh, thank you for watching the video and um, watch Jupiter Broadcasting shows. They're really good and insightful, and that's about it. Talk to you later, guys. Bye bye.